Hello, Chris Green here with the Flood Insurance Guru. And today we're talking about Salins Grove, Pennsylvania, and flood insurance changes coming to the area when it comes to flood maps. Today we're talking about when are these changes happening? And what are the good, the bad, and the ugly? What are your flood insurance options? Can you fight these changes? So let's talk about all these today. First of all, when is this happening? This is taking place on August 24th, 2021. Now let's talk about the good, the bad, and the ugly. Talk about the good. Maybe currently you're in a high risk flood zone and you're being moved out. That could be good for your property values and that could be good for your wallet. Now let's talk about the bad. The bad is, you could be moved from a low risk flood zone where flood insurance isn't required to a high risk flood zone, having a major impact on your property value and your wallet. What about the ugly? Well, the ugly is that you might actually be moved from a high zone to a high risk zone, having an even bigger impact on your wallet when it comes to these changes. So that's the good, the bad, and the ugly. Now let's talk about your flood insurance options. You have two options, the National Flood Insurance Program and Private Flood Insurance. And what we're talking about here is what, maybe whether you have an FHA loan, maybe you have a conventional loan or other type of loan. Remember, as we stand here now, right now in 2020, FHA only allows policies to go through the National Flood Insurance Program. But it's important that if you take out a policy that you take out a newly mapped policy if you're being moved from a low risk to a high risk instead of a standard policy. This could be a difference of $1,500 a year for you. But if you don't have an FHA, then you might qualify for private flood insurance, which could be significantly less with better coverage for you. So these are all things to pay attention to. So what about fighting the elephant in the room? Can you? Yes. We help people fight these changes every day. If a flood map has been changed, it's not uncommon for the flood map maybe to be wrong for your structure if it's based on your parcel. You know, we help remove people from high risk flood zones to low risk flood zones every day, making sure that their flood premiums match their flood risk correctly. So if you've got questions on how to do this, click below to visit our website, floodinsuranceguru.com. Remember, we have an educational background in flood mitigation, which means we can help you understand flood risk like this right here. Your flood insurance and mitigating your property long term. Thank you.